that's Smilo Dawn. It means knife tooth. Welcome to the Ice Age, a million years ago, and to my tar pits. The dinosaurs have all along vanished. Mammals like me are all over the place. Stop, you can't go this way. Don't get mad at me. You should know that I am a little bit smaller than a lion, but there are some differences between us. Like I'm much, much heavier. And of course, my choppers are huge. Oh yeah, I'm built for ambush hunting. What the? Ugh, you've gotta be kidding me, a puddle of tar? All kinds of animals wander into the tar pits and get trapped. But not me because... Ah! Because your mother told you not to go near them, right? Thousands of Smilodon fossils have been found in tar pits in what is now known as North America. In California, we're the state fossil. Don't forget to wash behind your ears. I hate taking baths. Well, maybe you should stay out of the tar pits and you won't have to have so many. That's what I call fresh air on the open range. My name is Ineosaurus. That's i ne o -saurus. It means buffalo lizard. Did you know that I'm from what is now known as Montana? Only here, nowhere else in the world. You know, there's more to the late Cretaceous period than trees and stinky flowers. I'm a ceratopsid. That means I'm a herbivore. I eat plants. And I have a beak. And we have these big curved horns on our noses. Looks like a big bottle opener, doesn't it? Too bad there's no such thing as bottles in the late Cretaceous period. And I live in a big herd, which is great if there are any big dinos around that might be a threat. Just one of us might not be enough to scare off a big gobbler dino, even though we're six meters long and weigh two tons. But put us all together, and there is safety in numbers. And hey, if that doesn't work, there's always the old stampede! just saying hello to the sun. You wait right here, babies. Mama's just gonna go talk to these folks for a minute. I'm Gallimimus. That's ga -li -mim -mus. My name means chicken mimic. A mimic is someone who copies someone else, but I don't think I copy a chicken at all. to know what chicken is as long as me. From the top of my head to the tip of my tail, I'm almost as long as a big car. there. You see, even though I have these really big, pretty eyes, I can't tell how far away things are, or even things right in front of me. I have to look sideways, like this. My babies! Oh, this is so exciting. I wonder what they'll be. 
<gasps> Baby Gallimimuses, just what I wished for. Well, I better start feeding them. Bye! and welcome to the late Jurassic period 144 million years ago. You say my name, Torvosaurus. It means savage lizard. <coughs> Gee, what is going on with my roar box? I'm a theropod, which means I walk on two legs and I eat meat. A meat eater is called a carnivore. I am the largest meat eater in these parts. I'm one of the biggest theropods ever, over 10 meters long. And these thumb claws, they help me hunt for food. I'm from what's now known as the Midwestern United States. Yeehaw! That's better. Now let me try a good one. <laughs> Hi, I'm Velociraptor. Yes, the famous Velociraptor. The Lossa Raptor. It means speedy thief. See my long tail? It lets me run really fast. <sighs> Whew, but not for too long. Didn't know I had feathers, huh? I need them to keep me warm. Because, well, 85 million years ago, it sometimes got pretty cold around here. And where is here? It's what is now known as Northern China. I'm not very big either. If you compare me to my cousins like the T-Rex. But like them, I'm a meat eater and I walk on two legs. But I'm just about the size of a big turkey. <laughs> in a pack. In fact, this whole time my pack has been watching us. Eva! Shh. <laughs> uh, nothing like spending a day playing with your friends. Eight, nine, ten. Ready or not, here I come. Bye. <laughs> Oh, hi! Uh, oh! Welcome to the late Cretaceous period, uh, about 140 million years ago. Ah! I live in the land that is now known as Argentina! Uh -huh. yeah! Yuck! That stuff tastes like, well, grass. Okay, as you may have guessed, I'm not a herbivore. A plant eater, like those Trubaria. I, I'm Gigantosaurus, the longest meat-eating dino who ever lived. You say my name like this, Gig and O Saurus. It means giant southern lizard. <laughs> ah! I'm as big as a boat, and I'm just as heavy at eight metric tons. You're looking at the biggest head of any theropod that ever lived. But uh, I have the smallest brain. It's about the size of... of a banana. Ah! Hi! I found you! Ugh. 
the only thing that really terrifies us Gigantosauruses, little sisters. Okay, sis, wanna go hunting? Yes! Will you do the roar for me? Sure, sis. Eh, she likes it when I do that. Oops, didn't see you there. Welcome to my forest 66 million years ago. I'm Leptoceratops. Leptoceratops. My name means skinny, horned face. It's good practice for when I get older, when I have to bonk heads with other dinos. We stand, look at the other guy, and bonk heads! Like this. Whoa! <laughs> good one. You see, lucky for me, I belong to a very special group of dinosaurs. We have these hard heads. It's like built-in safety gear. I have my own helmet. Oh, and see, we also have a beak, like a parrot. And we like to eat plants. I can walk on two legs or four legs. I'm powerfully built. I'm about the same size as a horse, but much more powerful. Here, let me show you. Watch out! I think I better keep practicing, but somewhere else. Bye. Oops, sorry about that. I thought that he might be hiding in there. Oh, by the way, I'm Mega Raptor. That's Mega Raptor. You may have noticed that I'm in a bit of a rush. So I haven't got a whole lot of time to chat. Aha! Uh -huh. Hey, wait a sec! Come back here! I'm as tall as a diving board. if you can help me with something. It's Mother's Day, and I have no idea what to get my mum. Do you have any ideas? A bag of nuts! That would be a great idea. But nope, she hates nuts. We're carnivores, and we don't eat plants. That's a great idea! Happy Mother's Day, Mom! Oh, aren't they precious? Hi, I'm Plesiosaurus. You say that Plesiosaurus. My name needs near lizard, and this is the early Jurassic period 180 million years ago. I have to gather up the babies and get them to school. Okay, it's time for school, you three. Our four flippers let us move through the water as easily as flying through the air. It's our best defense against predators bigger than us here in the water. Oh my, now where do they go? And this is the other defense we have against predators. We blend into the underwater scenery. <laughs> Got you! I'm a medium-sized plesiosaurus, as you can see. I'm only slightly larger than a human being. Oh, and plesiosaurus are not actually dinosaurs. 
We're big reptiles who live in the water. The way you can tell us apart from dinosaurs is what our legs look like. Mine are springing like this, and dinosaur legs go up and down like a human's. Anyway, plesiosaurs eat lots of fish, and our teeth are mesh, so when we grab a fish, we never let go. Our fossils have been found in many places because a lot of the Earth was covered with water in the Jurassic period. See? I got you to go to school after all. I think it's time for recess, don't you? Let's go to the top for some air. Bye! Hi, everybody. I'm Supersaurus, and welcome to my home here in the late Jurassic period 150 million years ago. My name means super lizard because I'm so big, one of the biggest dinos ever. You going to eat those? Yes, Charlie. I'm going to eat those. We have to eat all day long. It's the only way we can grow this big. Uh, I feel faint. I'm wasting away. <laughs> I need to eat something. But right now, I have to find a pond or river so my herd can have a drink after we mow this field. Water, water, I need water. I'm 43 meters long and 16 meters high. That's super sized, all right. <sighs> so thirsty, I'm delirious. Mother, is that you? No, Charlie, I'm not your mom. She's back there with the rest of the herd. My neck is really long, but I don't lift it up high as it's too heavy, but it's perfect for pushing through the trees to find more food or, hey, water. Hey, don't take it all. It's my turn. Come on, move over. Don't worry, Charlie. There's plenty for everyone. I'm going to tell the herd I found water. We live in what is now Western Colorado in the USA. Hey, everyone. There's water in the conifer forest over there. You going to eat those? Ah, beautiful view, isn't it? Hi, I'm Pteranodon. You say it. Pteranodon, and it means winged and toothless. That's right. In my beak, I have no teeth. Do you want to know a secret? Hey, Trinodon, I'm going to the picnic now. Oh, the dino picnic. Really? Do you think I can come? Yeah, sure. Every dino can. Remember that secret I want to tell you? Well, the secret is that I'm not a- So OK. Let's go. I'm from what is now Kansas, in the USA. But that's not the secret. Secret? I love secrets. I have hollow bones to make me light, and I have a huge wingspan, about 10 meters wide. That's as wide as a hand glider. That's not a secret, Pteranodon. OK, fine. Do you want to know my secret? Well, here it is. I'm not a dinosaur. <coughs> That's right. I'm not a dino at all. I'm a flying reptile. I'm related to the dinosaurs, but not actually one myself. I guess I can't come to the dinosaur picnic now. By the way, dinosaur means great lizard. As far as I'm concerned, it also means friend. Yippee! <laughs> Thanks, T-Rex. You're the best. My best friend and I are going on a picnic. See you later. Oh.